Yes, yes, Massive Crew back once again with another video and I've just found this tune called Ragadon and it is a little banger. Check the flavour. So I'm just using Fix This to try and skiv. Okay, tune started again now. Ragadon, man, check it out. Ragadon. Archiving some discs, literally having to use fix this to fix the dodgy sectors and write them to RAM. Once they're written back to RAM, hopefully I'll be able to load this whole song and see if there's any other samples in it. But this song at the moment, I'm just loving it, mate. Check out the flavour, little cheeky ragadon. Yes. Come on, man. Look. Check this out, guys. This Mac is updating itself. I can't believe it. It's been nagging me, nagging me with this stupid Sierra update, yeah? Which I don't want to do. And that somehow all my programs just shut down and it forced me to update. Now, this is definitely one thing I can't stand about Mac, yeah? Like, for me, if Mac's working, just leave it alone, yeah? If all your programs are working now, what's gonna happen now? I'm gonna update this now, and I'm just worried now that I'm gonna get all kinds of ridiculous compatibility issues. Now, it's updating to High Sierra. Hopefully it's reversible. A week of headache now, watch. On the bright side, maybe it'll sort out my mouse lag issue. It's worth a peep. So guys, after two hours, my light's on. Screen's still gone. Move the mouse. Nothing happening. As much as I love my Mac here, yeah, I'm at the end of my tether with this Mac now. This Mac, I put a lot of time and effort into this Mac to get it to where it is today and I just feel that the whole Mac platform seems to be falling apart mate it's you know I've had a dodgy mouse that's been lagging and now one stupid update which I didn't even want to do it just they just nag you so much on the screen until you accidentally press install there's no not that this time option so guys, after doodling around, I managed to figure out what the issue was. Um, I couldn't see my boot screen because I had an aftermarket graphics card and that allowed me basically to run sort of higher end programs and move forward with my OS. Unfortunately, um, I had to have these web drivers installed and by this false update, um, it caused the drivers to knock out, which means I had to take out my old graphics card that I had sitting about, my HD 5770, put it back in my Mac so I could see the boot screen to be able to diagnose the problem and then download the drivers, reinstall them and then shut down my Mac and then literally take out uh, my old card, put in my new one and voila, I was back to normal again. But it's hassle you don't really need to be fair. Right, okay, screen's changed now. And now I've just got a white screen. So there's no at this, oh, it's come back into this again. So let's see where it goes from here. As you can see, it's just a Mac logo with this no progress bar, just a black full progress bar. Okay, so it's booting back up into my, my Mac OSS, OS X, which is a good news for me. As you can see, I'm back in with the old card, the one with the boot screen. But it would not boot with my GeForce, my new GeForce card, which is a good card, but it's just one of those cards that work with the Mac. Um, but I just wish that OS X would do some sort of compatibility check before it decides to install on your computer Because it shows up in um, you know about this Mac the card So, you know, why is it such a big problem? It's really annoying Really really annoying. I just I've reached the end of my tether with this now and I'm just thinking about 
getting a bad boy Windows 10 M uh, MC. Get back. <laughs> getting a bad boy Windows 10 computer, man. Super computer, just to see where I'm at. Um, PC guys, when's the last time you had a blue screen? When's the last time your PC crashed with all your DAO and all your stuff in there? I just I'm scared to go back to PC making music. Uh, but at the same time, this is a nightmare. It really is. This updating every five minutes, making your computer more slow, obsolete. You know, it's just, it's, it's a nightmare. Anyway, peeps, let me see how I get on. Good news, guys. Got it back working. Uh, it turned out the web, uh, NVIDIA web drivers needed to be reinstalled when you update OS X. Bit of a pain in the backside. I had to pull out my computer. Uh, let's see if it fixes my mouse lag problem. I'm back in the building.